Wow, it's not often you see that, is it? Road, rail, canal and river all together in a line. Welcome back everybody, we are back cruising. Oh, it's a beautiful day. Yeah. Haven't yeah. got a hat on. It's about 12 degrees yeah. at the moment. Yesterday was even warmer, but it wasn't such a nice day. Oh, but the sun spring today. is in the air, guys. Yeah, it definitely is. It's lovely. As soon as the snow drops. Been here for a few days, done a few days work on the van. Yeah, done quite a bit, haven't you? The sky has done really nice, I guess. Ooh, but, quick. Uh, yes, yeah, so we haven't done it. much in regards to now, but we've done quite a lot on the van recently just up there on the road and um busy road there don't you? yeah we're off today we're, we're gonna go cruise all the way to Handsacre today which is about 14 miles and four locks quite a way but um if we did about five miles we'd end so up in Rugeley like yeah so um yeah, we've only got four locks but it is a lovely day uh, so let's go enjoy it oh yeah I forgot to mention but I checked the stoppages and they've been updated, right? <laughs> so, the Macclesfield one, right at the start of Macclesfield, all green. That is going to open today, actually, funny enough. But Just as we change our plans. No, it doesn't matter though, because the Marple Lock flight, guys, oh my God. the one that's subsided on that, is going to open on the 25th of May, if all things go to plan. Now, they predicted, they said, oh, we're trying to get it open for Easter. But that's not going to happen. The end of March, I think, isn't it? So we'd be waiting around for absolutely <laughs> months to get through there. So what oh, I should have I pity, done. I pity the people that are stuck yeah, there. I know. But yeah, what I should have done is just um, headed up for Anton before that lock closed on the eighth, and headed down north at Middlewich instead of up the Trent and Mersey. But um, yeah, I didn't realise that the Macclesfield one had collapsed at that time, and I didn't realise. <laughs> um, that the Marple Rock flight was going to be shut for nine months. In hindsight. <laughs> 17th of uh, August that broke down. And uh, <laughs> it's finally going to reopen the 25th of May. Which is, uh, yeah, crazy. Yeah. Um, 
Anyway, so that's yeah. <laughs> Bit of nail in the coffin really. Anyway. You know, if we did really want to head north, we should have headed down Heartbreak Hill again, but come on, I don't no, want to head down there again. No, it's a better to do it today, this year, today. Yeah. This year, because of the baby's been due, isn't it? So yeah. We'll be down south, so... Yeah, we've, got, we've got to go to Ilfkin quite a lot this year, so... It's better off being close than <laughs> six or seven hours away. Spring is well and truly on the way. I was quite upset that the boat scared off this goose because it has a really damaged wing. I'm actually surprised it could fly that far. You may notice here in Weston, there's an arm, and this is the Weston Salt Works arm. This was part of Staffordshire's salt industry, but it was never on the same scale as Cheshire or Worcestershire, and was always limited to evaporating brine. Nonetheless, it was an important industry and continued production until the 1960s. Salt making was established here as early as 1686. Salt making was established here as early as 1686, and the export was considerably boosted when the Trent Mersey Canal came through here. And that's when the arm was built to the works. Good time and a boat just showed up at the bottom. It's on our side anyway. I asked the lady if it was okay if I get back on. And she said, yeah, that's fine. So I got back on and then I actually went down the lock on my parts. Got a bit of something hanging from your mouth, mate. Hmm. Daffodils and snowdrops. Just round the other side of these reeds are some visitor moorings. And just as we were going through, and bear in mind it's quite narrow. The boat decided to take off from those moorings, but because of the reeds, they couldn't see us. So a bit of manoeuvring had to be done.
my subscriber. Slashbox. It's so settled up in there as well. It's a shame it's not being used. I wonder what the hell's going on in this field over here. And I just have a guess what it is, and you probably already know. It's that bloody HS2 again, isn't it? Coming through here and ruining the green belt. I'm pretty sure we saw a lovely gorse hawk here, but it could have been a buzzard. I'm not too sure Dad wasn't there. But it isn't a woodland, so it's more likely to be a goshawk. It's a shame they don't have a smelly vision yet, yeah, because it was pump out day for the septic tank at Great Haywood. And here we are at Great Haywood Junction. That is the start of the Staffordshire and Worcestershire Canal. Even if we want to do that canal, which we don't, we can't at the moment, because uh, it's actually closed down there until the 23rd of February. I just had to show you this bridge here because it is very special actually. It's the Essex Bridge of Great Hayward and it is the longest surviving pack horse bridge in England. It was built in 1550 by the then Earl of Essex for Queen Elizabeth I. And it was literally just built so when she visited the estate she could go hunting in the woodland nearby.
one here ever got through Great Hayward so smoothly as that. I know. It was lovely, wasn't it? Yeah. All the locks are on our side. No, no queuing. Yeah, we were hoping to wave to Mark Agents. We did. Hi there. Yeah, we did point your boat out. Yeah, so. we put your boat out westward and um, we were hoping to say hello to you, but you weren't there, darling, but hi there. <laughs> but uh, yeah, it's just such a lovely spring, it's not spring, but it's still spring day. Yeah, it's nice. Yeah, it's so mild and you hear the birds and it's calm. It's lovely. Yeah. But we're through, we're through Great Hayward again. Um, didn't, yeah. stop, didn't stop the water, we should have. But... Yeah, we should have. But we get, we get some water in Rugeley, don't worry about that. Yeah. Let's hope so, let's go with our luck, the, the tap will be broken. The tap. <laughs> Like that's ever gonna happen. What a lot of water. I think we have to go to the Great uh, Bradley Junction. <laughs> Which will be a really long cruise. Yes. But uh, yeah, anyway. Now we're just the same plating, no obstacles in our way. About uh, 10 miles, 9 miles, I think. We're just cruising. So yeah, let's enjoy. Juicy logs. Ugh, too thick for our chainsaw though. That is the edge of the ancient and beautiful Canic Chase, which is said to be extremely haunted. shoes yet man. We're still here. It's the tins. I absolutely love it when a river just runs right next to a canal and you can just walk over the bank to the river. It's especially great in the summer when you want to cool off. Before I treat you guys to a second flight of the drone in this video, it's just such a beautiful area around here I just want to show you from the sky.
never see anyone in there though. Reminds me of the swan. Yeah. Did notice that. Thank God for that. The will weaving willow has been cut. I can see where we're going now. We've got a lot of that today, haven't we? Yeah. Right, time to fill up on some water. Wait, hang on. What's going on here? We're on the Rougely water point here. <laughs> we got here and thought, what the hell's going on here? There's a van filling up on water. Yeah. Never seen that before. She's, um, um, the lady's got a narrow boat, a private mine, mooring down uh, there. I so, thought they would have their own water points. Yeah. But they don't. But I thought so. It's a CRT one. Yeah. But I, I, she said the same as bringing the um, boat up. So she brings a van up, fills up. And goes back. But I said to Josh back then, I said, Oh, crikey, we haven't, we haven't filled up at Great Hayward. I bet the next one's going to be broken and we definitely and need was. water. And guess what? It's been broken for a week. It's been broken for a week and it's just been repaired about an hour and a half ago. Yeah, which is really weird <laughs> for us. Which is lucky well, for I've us. I've been checking the stoppages every day and didn't, I don't think I even saw this. Well, it was a stoppage. I don't know. No, but usually we're very unlucky and yeah. I. But we were very lucky today. Because it's lovely that, I thought we'd have to go into all the way to Fradley today. Hopefully <laughs> <laughs> not. They all think it's time to go out now because we've stopped. Because <laughs> you've stopped. What the hell is he doing? <laughs> Herb! Well, it's half free now. We're just filling up on water now. So. Somebody's crazy. Got about an hour of cruising left and. Uh, and about an hour of light by the time this water's filled up, so we'll probably get there in dark, or just above four dark. <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> Went to grab me and then clean his face. Mm. Hey, baby. No. <laughs> Settling in like her Toby's stop hissing now. Yeah, at the moment. A bit, a bit of weepy eyes, isn't he? He's grown already. Yeah, he's lovely. A little windy. <laughs> Ash is a bit more cautious with him. Come on, play with me. Play with me. Come on, play with me, Ash. Oh, he's attacking her. He's tail on the tongue. <laughs> oh my god! He's trying to get in the hole! <laughs> See how his little face sticking out? Half <laughs> <laughs> oh, his, his body's in the box! Oh my god! What's he doing, Herbie? Oh my god, he's going through! <laughs>
Scrooge. Well, this is the Armitage Tunnel. Well, used to be the Armitage Tunnel, built in 1770. And although the tunnel roof is no longer here because that was removed thanks to the silence damage by local coal mining. It's funny to see that when they made the cutting through here, they ran into some sandstone and they just used it for the base of the bridge. This is part of the uh, famous Armitage Toilets factory here. Tough luck. Someone's mourning our favourite spot through the bridge. Looks like we're gonna have to wild more, and uh, it's quite a shadow here, as you're here. Put the cat plank out. The little cat plank's out. Come on, they're strong enough for the yeah, cats. Yeah, they're all back in. Oh, God. <laughs> what happened there? Oh, my God. I got that on camera. What happened? So we've made it to Hans Acre. But not in, our, not in our spot. <laughs> yeah. Everything went well except for the mooring. Yeah, you wanted to get in, wanted to get in the one spot and there's a boat in the it's one It's a very spot. risky mooring there because... There's only about one spot. Well, you can get two 57s in, and maybe a, well, someone squeezed in front of us last time. I, know. But, um, well, I accidentally let all the cats out. It's five yeah. o'clock, and it's going to be getting dark, so we want them all in. But we've got three of them in. Yeah, it's like yeah, five o'clock. <laughs> Made it here just in light. Yeah, just in time. And what's that? I think it's six hour cruise. Yeah, about yeah. Uh, ten. Ten o'clock we left. Yes, we're at the water park. Oh, yeah, probably. Yeah. So, it's um, quarter past five. Yeah, oh, quarter sorry. past five. We're going to some dinner. Yeah. We're going to stay here for the weekend until Dad comes back. And, uh, yeah, we've just got to put the bird feeders out. We can't get, trouble is, we yeah. can't, because we're on um, pins, we can't get off. Yeah, it's very shadow here as well. The, the boat is grounded, so we're <laughs> a bit of an angle. Well, it's like we need, pumping it's like out. we need pumping out. Well, we've already pumped out. So we're a bit like that at the moment. But, no anyway, worries. everything went well except for getting to the morning. We'll see, maybe here, here go at some point and we'll just pull the boat onto the arm. Yeah. Car. You can see Herbie and that bloody kitten. <laughs> Hello. Hello again. Oh, what's happening? <laughs> He's great fun. Hindi. Hindi. Don't attack me. Herbie's scared. The giant. He's very, very good boy though. He's very placid with him. Yeah. He plays nice with him. He doesn't get horrible with him. And he does jump. <laughs> <laughs> really quickly went inside the box. <laughs> oh my god, it's not very prepared for him in there. <laughs> oh, 
It's a bit of a restricted area. Oh, yeah, get me out of here. 